Kent Highway Services have a different approach to tackling Kent's winter roads this year with a larger supply of salt. The service will run from the 25th of October till the end of March. We cover our A and B roads, which is about a third of the county's network. Those are our primary routes and we will do those when we get snow and ice on the ground. We do those first and then if we've got the resources we'll then do our secondary routes, which are other important roads in the county. We have a responsibility to treat the town centres, but what we're doing this year, we're working much more closely with our district council partners and they will be treating the town centres, including the pavements, because we know that last year there was a problem with the pavements and many people were concerned about them. So we will be working much more with the district councils to make sure that town centres and pavements are cleared. The parishes this year, we're doing this for the first time, the parishes will be supplied with a, a small amount of salt and grit. That will be a selection of parishes across the county, not all of them, and they'll be able to treat areas in their local area that they have identified as being ones that suffer difficulty during snow and ice um, conditions. We were very prepared last year, but clearly it was the worst winter for 30 years, so many parts of the country did suffer for that. But we never ran out of salt in, in Kent, and we've got 23,000 tonnes of salt in stock at the moment. We've also got 66 vehicles that, which go out and, and salt the roads. And this year, for the first time, we've got some smaller vehicles, which we'll be using in smaller roads to make sure that some of the narrow roads or roads with parked cars can be treated when there's snow. So we'll definitely make sure that, that we get all that covered. We've worked over the years with over 180 farmers very successfully and they keep those local rural routes open which is, which is very important for our rural economy. So we want to work with more farmers in the future. We know that over the years sometimes ones drop out for various reasons so we're making a call for other farmers to come on board. If you are a farmer who might be interested in working with the council in keeping your local roads ploughed, visit kent.gov.uk to apply.